I remembered this game I used to play. Nobody at school had it. But I was super into it for some reason. It was called Death Man. It was a side-scrolling action game. It was like a clone of one of those famous Japanese games. But it was so cool. These aliens from the planet Death take over Earth, and they print the human scores on their arms. Intelligence and beauty. If either score drops below 100, they get killed. A murder show begins. But one man put a stop to this terrible game. That's right, it's Death Man. Death Man fights against the Death Aliens. To protect the planet Earth, he kills off all ten of the top evil Death Aliens. Then, when he kills General Death at the end, Death Man reveals his true identity. Who really is Death Man? How did it end? I can't remember. I totally forgot. The mystery of Death Man is still unsolved for me. But that's about to change. A remake version was released. Now I can finally find out who Death Man really is. Finally! It's the last boss. The General Death. So today was a bust, too. <laughs> Best friends forever, Fu. Bye, Fu. You're going back to your home. 
Damon, I love you. In 20 years, I will return. 20 years? You really mean it, Phil? Promise? Damon, I will return. No matter what. Promise. Go, Fu! Sir, it is time for the board meeting. We need to go back in. Just give me a minute. I've got an appointment. But I am not aware of... Just watch. You've been living large, Damon. You used our powers to get yourself a pretty sweet piece of the pie. Are you really Fu? Thanks to you, I was able to return to my land. And now here I am, a full-on prince. Congratulations. But I'm hella bored. I got nothing to do. I wiped out the neighboring planet, but then I was court-martialed and exiled to the Black Hole Prison. These dudes are my buddies. We met in the hole. Nice to meet you, everyone. Hey, Damon, let's team up and make this planet ours. Ours? What do you mean? I'm talking about taking it over, duh! Do it! What did you do? Apparently, superheroes are popular in this country. So we're gonna jump on that. Right, Mr. Big Shot? Fu... What are you? I'm a goddamn superhero. Was today the 4th of July? If not, is the Empire striking back or what? Looks like things are gonna get weird today. Hey, what a shitty town. What could possibly even be here? Like, what the hell is the Prince even worried about? Eh, whatever. Let's destroy it.
Who are they? Hey, can I ask you something? Are you guys aliens? I don't think they're here to talk, Master. Oh, shit! This looks like fun! Let me play! You know how to take these guys down? Beat them to fucking death! Strategy is born from battle. I'll take the one in the middle. Do whatever you want with the rest. Let me have some fun, fucking losers! Let's go! Start the game. Hey gamers, limit your gaming to 10 hours today. Any more, and you're seriously gonna die. Hope everyone's doing great today. Your good old girl next door, Sylvia, is going to introduce another new game today. Today's title is No More Heroes 3. After the opening sequence, we will take a closer look. Gamers have but one goal. To take down the opponent in front... <laughs> Hurry up and grab the controller! The game has already started! Ready? Right you know what to do, right? <laughs> Just destroy... <laughs> All those nasty aliens! They are right before your eyes. Is this? Are these really aliens? Juvie, check this out. All right. Its atomic composition is unknown. I will expand the range of this search to include the entire galaxy. I had a hit. World ending supernova, an energy stone of the planet Jess Baptiste. So they really are aliens. Things are getting real funky real quick. Mission accomplished. It was way too easy. Where are the rest of them? It's only polite to accept an invitation to kick ass. Kick ass! Master, I believe the time has come to use it. Loading the DD system. Awaken, sister. You're behind enemy lines now. Huh? Gene? Have you always sounded like that? Something wrong? No. It's just... I always assumed you were a female. Are you tweaking? This is how I've always sounded. That's pretty badass. 
If there's anything you're not clear on, let me know. I'll lay it out for you. Ah, uh, so you're basically my navigator, huh? Come on, man. Don't underestimate my prowess in battle. I'm right up there with pick. Yeah, let's not use that comparison anymore. It's gonna make things more confusing. Strawberry! Right on! Sorry! Raspberry! Double kill! Blueberry! Triple kill! I'm taking you down! As you can see, things got all funky real quick. There's probably some planet-eating type dude waiting for me up ahead. All yoked and powerful and trying to take over the world or something. But don't you worry. A hero descends. What? There are no heroes in this world? Oh, but there totally are. My name is Travis Touchdown. I'm the last hero around. Here to save the world. I'm also just a passing assassin. Here we go. Taking a kill trip on death row. It's me. Sylvia, is that you? You know what to do, don't you? If you want to keep living a comfortable life, kill them all. Unleash the insanity, Travis. Let it flow. The pure, primitive insanity. The Garden of Insanity is awaiting your return. Ah, oh, my stomach hurts. Too many beers. Oh, shit, I need a toilet. Perfect location. Oh, yeah, don't forget. Always stop by the toilet if you find one, especially before boss fights. You need time to get your thoughts in order. Uh, so, you know, save your damn game.
Here we go. Gene, where are we? In the core of the spacecraft. <sighs> so this is where the real hardcore bad guys are. What's that egg? You know, like in that famous movie where a monster pops out of the egg and attacks. Hey, the egg is cracked. Something not so good is gonna come out of that thing. Buddy? Oh, you're so good at walking, aren't you? <laughs> yes, you are. <laughs> Let me pick you up, little guy. Oof. Where am I? This is my planet. Well, now it's a hellscape with nothing but a graveyard and a galactic waste disposal site. <laughs> this is where we grew up. My boss, Fu, he went bad shit crazy. Destroyed the whole planet. Ah, ain't that a bitch? 
It is indeed. So why not get revenge? Revenge against who? We wouldn't last three damn seconds against him! Are you okay with a life of submission? Well, that's how I've lived. It's my destiny. Rethink this. You can still go back. Go on back to space. Nope, no can do. Either way, Fu is gonna kill me. I see. Yeah, about that destiny. I'll put an end to that for you. Sounds good. <laughs> okay, wanna get started? Where is this? 
inside him. We're basically in his universe. Well, that sucks. I'll begin searching for hostiles. So that asshole is hiding somewhere among these billions of stars, huh? Uh, Not there, Travis. Where is he? Where the hell are you, black hole? Calm down, Travis. Go left. Left? Oh, left. Henshi! <laughs> there! Fuckhead! Never smart as 
special kill. Don't underestimate Earthlings. Thank you. <laughs> now I've got the Travis touchdown data I needed. What data? Uh, statistics from your behavioral and strategic patterns. Fine. Do whatever you want with that. I'm more badass than a black demon. Okay, everyone. I'm leaving the rest up to you. Prince Fu. Seriously. Ever since way back when, you really... Congratulations, Travis. Sylvia? Is it really you? How are the kids? You have managed to take down the number 10 ranked Black Hole. And you have been recognized as number 10 in the Galactic Rankings. Number 10 in what rankings? Rules are rules. The battle has already begun. You are in the eye of the storm. So you cannot escape or just disappear. You can only fight here. So I need to win, huh? Yes. And what happens once I take everyone out? For reals? I'll do it. Please, let me do it. Okay. Now go out and earn the entry fee for the next battle. Also, what are these guys? Where'd they even come from? Sorry, I'm sort of in a hurry. I'll mail you later, so be sure to check it out. Hey, wait! Sylvia, there's something I need to talk to you about. One is gone. Did Black Hole get killed? I see. Dead, huh? <laughs> That's kind of funny. It was that man. Hmm. Somebody you know? Looks like not all humans are weaklings after all. <laughs> this ought to be fun. Sir, it is time. Okay. Oh, time for a meeting? Sweet. Let me watch. Foo, wait. This is a board meeting. It's important.
This is a bitchin' room. Nice work, Damon. You're really coming up, huh? And you even followed my orders like a good little boy, too. <laughs> Foo, I told you, this is a board meeting. Please keep quiet and sit down over there. So, these are like really capable dudes, huh? Of course. They're specialists in a wide range yeah. of... Yeah. Bunch of losers. Well, we're even more capable. So it's cool if I go ahead and fire these guys. Right, Damon? What have you done? Stop this! Oh, don't worry. You're a good secretary. I'll allow you to live. Ah! Okay, that's enough for the entertainment. Time for a strategy meeting. Damon, whip out the blueprints for the fighting arena. It's here. What are these blueprints? Who made these? So this city was just built without permission? Oh, come on. You've heard of LASIK before, right? Do you still remember? You mean... Ah! Taking over this planet is too simple and boring. So I decided to go with a game of conquest. <laughs> Wouldn't it be hella fun if we got some humans to take on the galactic superhero rankings? Apparently some asshole took out Black Hole. Hey you! Secretary! Get the president on the line. The president? Did you not hear me? So, destroying the planet, that was your plan ever since way back then? Cute little me from back then and the handsome ass me now, we're the same. Nothing's changed. Come on, Damon. Trust me. He is on the line, sir. Mr. President, you're gonna hold an emergency press conference. Let's make a joint announcement. I will not. Whatever you thugs are- Oh, okay then. I guess I've got no choice. Do it. I am Jess Baptiste the Sixth, AKA Foo. I'm Prince of the Baptiste system, and you can call me Lord Foo. Listen up, Earthling aliens. I'm about to conquer this planet, but simply conquering it is no fun. And there's probably gonna be some resistance. I understand you people. So I'm gonna provide you with an opportunity. We're gonna play a game. A game of conquest. I won't run or hide. I'll be a Damon Tower in Utopia Land. Anyone is welcome. <laughs> Looks like we've got a contestant already! I don't know what army tossed that thing over this way, but I admire the motivation and the quick thinking. Nice move. Looks like someone out there's really got some balls. However, <laughs> make no mistake. You think you can kill me with those primitive ass firecrackers? You wanna kill me? Come kill me. You'll have ten of the most elite dudes in the galaxy awaiting you. Or, well, one of them got killed. So nine, I guess. Take us all out, and we'll go home. Otherwise, we take over. The rules are simple enough, right? All right, Mr. President. <laughs> the game of death begins. The year 2021. The huge entertainment-based theme park built in Santa Destroy, Utopialand, would no longer be holding its grand opening in two months. It was instead converted into the Garden of Insanity. Hesitate, and you are dead. The Colosseum that would hold the alien's game of conquest. Fu and nine of his aliens are dispatched into formation, prepared to destroy the planet any time. Five on Earth, two in the sky, one on the moon, one in space. Fu sits in the central tower, and his nine soldiers, all recognized by the United Assassins Association, 
descend to Earth as the Galactic Superhero Ranking members. The following ten have been registered as members of the rankings. Number ten. The Passing Assassin, Travis Touchdown. Number nine. The Space Ore Dealer, Gold Joe. Number eight. The Alien Kidnapper, Black Knight Direction. Number seven. The Memory Thief, Vanishing Point. Number six. The Gastro Cannon, Velvet Chair Girl. Number five. The Dark World Princess, Midori Midorikawa. Number four. The Galactic Sniper Champion, Sniping Lee. Number three. The Demon God, Sonic Juice. Number two. The Master of Explosion, Paradox Bandit. Number one. Our own King of Destruction, Jess Baptiste the Sixth. The all-out, all-star battle of space versus Earth. The ultimate battle of top-class space criminal versus assassin is about to kick off. Ten hours of gaming per day. Hmm. Not bad. Not bad at all. It was designed exactly according to your input. You could show a bit of appreciation, you know. Did I not just say... not bad? I'll help with the next one, too. Mr. Gold Joe has arrived. Ooh, let him in. All right.
Lord Fu! Gold Joe is back! That Earthling called Travis. I'm leaving him to you. Oh, I'm honored. All the credit shall go to you, of course. What's that? It was dug out of a nebula behind the Milky Way. It's Galactica Rolling Thunder Rainbow. It's got a nice shine to it. I'll take good care of it. It'll give you great power. Now, I'll go destroy that Earthling myself. He's much weaker than you, but be careful. He's a wily bastard. You have nothing to worry about. <laughs> Don't kill him off too quickly. Ooh, a quick kill. That sounds like a nice plan. I'm going out. Where to? So, what do you think about Miike's latest production? The girls' series was a proving ground. Miike used it to help him get to the next stage. It's like a treasure chest of production. By preparing so many different stages to test out just how far Japanese CG technology can go, he's pouring his passion into the improvement of systematized techniques. Damn, Travis. You really hit the nail on the head. The incubator of the new idol chosen in the audition that's just as transient for him. And nobody notices that the true awesomeness of Miike is in the fact that he used this film shoot as a way to further his own technical staff. So basically, in the next Yakuza apocalypse-style full-on Miike film, these systematized techniques are really gonna come alive, right? Miike is a greedy dude. A hella greedy dude. That Takashi Miike, man. Huh? I guess they're here. Looks like it's about time to get to work. Yeah, let's go. Which one? Huh. 